Hey guys, this is EJ Holland with TheWolverine.com, and I was in Florida over the weekend seeing on 300 2025 Michigan quarterback commit Carter Smith, number nine in black, and right away, you see him get physical there as a runner. You're going to see a lot of clips of him early on just running the football. He's a true dual threat quarterback, and in this game, there was a bit of rainy conditions, and Bishop Ferro, his team, really leaned on him as a runner now he does escape pressure well but a lot of design runs for him as you can see here and he had a big game on the ground gaining 137 yards scoring three touchdowns so you know michigan obviously took Jaden davis in the 2024 recruiting class davis is a more efficient accurate passer really you know, high level technique from him, a high mental processing ability, knows how to read a defense, has been groomed to play the quarterback position his whole life, but he doesn't really have any mobility. When you look at Carter Smith, he's all upside as a passer. I think, uh, you know, the, you're seeing a, a couple of throws now, but he, he didn't do a whole lot as a passer, only 91 yards through the air. But Smith, again, all upside as a passer, but he's a guy that brings to the table something that Davis doesn't, which is the ability to create, the ability to make plays with your legs, the ability to have some designed runs in the offense to open things up. And you saw with the change at Michigan going from Cade McNamara to J.J. McCarthy, the offense just opened up a little bit in terms of being able to have more creativity. You definitely have that with Smith. Um, now, he does have a lot of work to do in terms of his footwork, in terms of his mechanics and you know just overall throwing motion as well but he has the arm talent this is a kid with a tremendous baseball background he actually grew up splitting between both sports his dad was in the minor leagues and smith himself threw in the 90s as a sophomore and you see he has a, a rocket arm he just doesn't know how to use it that well yet um but for someone to throw in the 90s as a sophomore that special arm talent uh, he did give up baseball and he's never focused on football full time. So this will be his first off season where he actually has a quarterback trainer. He's going to be doing specific things to help with the things I mentioned, uh, like the, the mechanics, the footwork, the throwing motion. So I'm really excited to see what Smith becomes once he's a senior, um, Right now, again, he's all upside. He is ranked as the number eight quarterback and the number 112 overall prospect in the country per on three. But the other sites, you know, are kind of all over the place. ESPN has him as a top 250 guy. 24-7 has him as a three-star. Rivals has him as a three-star. I think somewhere in the 200 to 250 range is fine right now, but I think Smith has a chance to really climb up the rankings once he polishes up as a passer.